Hi guys, welcome back. <clears throat> so this will be what you guys can expect from now till the end of the week. Okay, so this is how I'm going to do it. Um, I went ahead and just titled the groups. I randomly drew their cards, so you guys are the last four. Um, I have Scorpio, Taurus, Gemini, and uh, Cancer. Based on what I feel as the overall <laughs> message, I wanted to kind of keep it cute, and that's the vibe that, and that's the title you guys will get. And this is got this is gonna be what you guys can expect till the end of the week. Um, this isn't gonna apply to every Cancer, Scorpio, uh, Gemini, or Taurus, but just the ones that need to heal hear it. And I felt strongly while pulling the first group that somehow by doing it this way, maybe it's. In a way, I feel like those signs in particular groups are probably actually dealing with that particular sign. Alright. So let's see if I'm right. You guys let me know what you guys think. Um, a little bit of anxiety for a few of you who are waiting on something. Let's see if it comes out again. What can you guys expect? Alright. And this is just going to be, I'm going to try to read it really general, but I'm going to read it backwards and forwards. That way, I'm going to be able to try to get all of you guys. All right, I, do, I feel like they do somehow connect, so I do want to try to randomly draw them. Okay, Scorpio, Taurus, Gemini, Cancer. Let's see what's going on with you guys and what you guys could expect from now to the end of the week. I feel like that one's good. Okay. I don't know why I feel like doing that. This is what you guys are sharing. Coming out of the cold, no longer arguing, putting away conflicts, but still a little bit tied to the past. Wanting to leave, but unable to leave. This is kind of um, what all of you guys is for sharing. All right. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and start with Scorpio. Scorpio, I feel like right now you are probably somehow tied to a Sagittarius, if not an earth sign. Those are what's around you. Maybe a fire sign that isn't, if it's not specifically Sagittarius, you guys are ending conflicts coming from feeling this left out in the cold, or maybe that's how they feel about you. Gemini, I'm going to go ahead and do all of it real quick based on what I see first. Gemini, you guys are probably leaving, um, trying to start a new beginning with a Sagittarius. But you guys are at the same time trying to let go of this past. I'm going to clarify. Taurus, you guys are coming out from feeling left out in the cold. Um, many options are around you, but you're looking for the truth. I don't know if the truth is someone particularly a Cancer or an Aries. Um, you guys do have strong Scorpio. I feel like this group does somehow have some kind of relation. You guys all you guys all kind of have each other's cards in this group again, like how I felt in the other groups. Um, and it's funny. I just pulled Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn with a Libra and a Taurus. And someone's losing their independence. Someone's making a commitment. I feel like that was the truth that I was getting with the many options. And I feel probably that is a Taurus. Cancer, I'm getting that you guys are probably leaving behind a fire sign. You're ending this conflict with possibly Sagittarius. If not, you're no longer working on it. You're leaving it behind. I feel like you guys will definitely get the truth because you got my Aries card here. If it's not specifically an Aries, you guys are charging forward. And um, let's see, this new beginning, what is this, Gemini? You guys are leaving behind a water sign, very likely. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, balancing out your emotion. There's a Scorpio here. So if Gemini possibly could be debalancing out and leaving behind a Scorpio. If not, I feel like maybe it's behind this Aries. <clears throat> Somehow this um, Scorpio, Cancer, this water sign, you guys are heavily surrounded. You guys are water signs. You guys are heavily surrounded by fire signs right now. 
Um, that's just the feeling that I'm getting. Taurus, you guys are looking for the truth. And I feel like you guys just have this decision making about probably balancing your emotions just as much. Um, with an earth sign, if not, it's a Scorpio. What is this? Someone left you guys out in the cold. Scorpio and Taurus, you guys are my only ones that are like a little bit stagnant right now. I don't know what's wrong with you guys. Um, if you guys are okay, you guys, I feel like there's a little bit of mixed emotions in there. Cancer and Gemini, I feel like you guys are healing a little bit faster than my Scorpio and Taurus. Um, Ten of Pentacles, some new beginning is definitely coming. Something with finances are looking on the rise. Uh, home, stable, firm foundation with, um, you know, this firm character, authoritative, decision making, Aries. If it's not, I'm feeling very strong. Strong movements in my Gemini's and Cancer this week. Um, Scorpio and Taurus, you guys are falling a little bit behind. What's going on? Okay, yeah, you guys are letting it go and things are changing. You guys are a little bit delayed. The wheel's in reverse. I feel like whatever it is, things are just a little bit delayed because there are probably a lot of um, options for you guys to choose and unable to choose right now. Scorpio, you guys are letting it go. I feel letting it go, balancing your emotions everywhere. I don't feel like you guys are making any kind of decision about love this week. Yeah, you're letting it go. Probably Gemini. That's the Gemini's card. And it was reversed. And you're Gemini's right next to you. This new beginning Gemini's probably having to... <sighs> I feel like strongly I'm talking to a specific Gemini, specific Scorpio, dealing with each other. One wants a new beginning, one doesn't. Okay. And then why? Yeah. All of you guys, great. You guys are all going to have a wish, but I feel like there's some kind of delay. But you guys, yep, this waiting thing for this group. Okay, you guys are going to get it, but it's slowly going to come. You guys are moving a little bit slower. I feel it's so weird. It's so weird. It's, I feel like I, I, you guys are the most, you guys are fixed signs too. Scorpio, you're fixed. Taurus, you're fixed. And you um, Cancer, Gemini, you, G Gemini, you guys are kind of like, you know, me, indecisive a lot. So that's not a big surprise that you guys are not moving as fast. Cancer, you guys are feeling intensely about something right now. So there's, yeah, loss of apathy. Okay, so for this group, you guys, I'm going to call you guys in my, my, my slow pokes. <laughs> Just kidding. I don't know. I don't know what to call you guys yet. But I feel like there is slow healing. You guys are having a wish. You guys, something new is on the rise. I'm feeling that, like, something is right around the corner. But you guys... I just haven't answered it yet. The, if someone's knocking, you guys haven't answered it yet. That's kind of what I'm getting. Alright. Alright, let's see. Specific messages for Scorpio. Okay, maybe you guys are just very focused. You have pentacles all around you. You're working. I feel like finances and career. Taurus, something about your love life being affected by children. If it's not children, it's something that you have to really take care of. Um, that's, you know, strong ties, but let go of control issues, you deserve love, and honeymoon. Those all fell out and it's while I was talking to Taurus, so maybe something about that is strongly in there. Um, <clears throat> Gemini's. See what's going on with you. You guys definitely have a very positive. Gemini's, you're surrounded by your wish coming true. Um, making a wish, getting what you want, and the fool. However, feel like you're turning down a water sign or not. A water sign is turning you down so you can start on this new beginning. No longer waiting. I feel like Ten of Pentacles, you're going to have something very strong and stable, if not with an earth sign soon. Um, let's see what your overall message is. Let your friends help you and decide. <laughs> okay, Cancer. Um... You guys are dealing with this heavy fire. You got, I feel like these fires and waters are strongly yours. I feel like you're still unable to let go of the past. You're not. I feel like you um, are a little bit behind, but I feel like there's something heavier going on on your side. Yeah, you feel like maybe you will have time. Maybe you need time to express your love. You're feeling a little bit, yeah. Um, express your love and let go of control issues. There's some not like it doesn't have to be control issues, but just feeling like you haven't really let go yet. I'm getting strongly for this group. You guys are dealing with something heavier. Um, strong emotions are in here. Two of cups is in here. The lovers are in here. 
I mean, the wish card is in here. I feel like whatever you guys are leaving behind, you guys even have, yeah, reconciliation. I was about to say, you guys have balancing your emotions and now Sagittarius is somehow involved. Um, <clears throat> and it's, it's, I feel like this wish that you, this group is sharing, reconciliation, you guys are going to get it. But you guys have to let go of whatever it is that's kind of like torn you guys into pieces and you need to balance your emotions, this this break up you guys have something already coming towards you guys with the new beginning coming but you guys are all looking for the truth i feel like it's because all, all of you guys have not um um gemini are you guys a fixed sign no no, no. You, you you guys are immutable signs so that's why you guys can't decide cancer you guys um are not but you guys are <laughs> feel a little bit more um taurus and scorpio you guys are very fixed so you guys cannot move until you really make a decision and that's why you guys um need truth and clarity but once you guys i feel like reconciliation and that's probably what the wish is something's happening something is kind of like in the making but all of you guys are so confused <laughs> all right i'm gonna call this the confused form <laughs> i hope you guys have a great week bye guys